Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video, we'll be making food related slimes. Now these are not going to be edible, but they're going to be loads of fun. So, let's get started. Frosty's Corn Flakes and Milk Slime Enjoy hours of milky slime with frosted flakes, poking, stretching, pulling, squishing, and making all kinds of slime sounds. It's just like having a delicious sugary cereal bowl right in front of you. The texture is so thick, so luxurious, and it is so silky soft and glossy. You can play with this all day. Creme caramel slime? Creme cara slime. Use any good quality PVA glue. I'm using Elmer's glue. Add in the shaving foam. Adding in the foaming soap, body lotion. Generous amount of body lotion. Foaming face wash. Adding some baby powder, a few drops of baby oil. I'm going to be using this creme caramel instant dessert mix. Now this is very rich and creamy and this is going to be our base for the creme caramel slime. Add the entire sachet and mix very well. Add slime activator. I am using borax solution. The mixture should not stick to the bowl. It should still be a bit runny. Now this is tapioca flour. It is made from cassava, a starchy root vegetable. Like most flours, tapioca flour is a very fine white powder. Add the tapioca flour till you get the desired consistency. Add more for clay-like consistency and less for runny, glossy consistency. It's flavorless, so that's why it is used in both sweet and savory recipes. But we'll be using it as a thickener for the slime. Spread a little tapioca flour on the surface and knead the slime for final consistency. Creme caramel slime is ready. So glossy and not sticky at all. Now, I like this consistency. Remember, add more or less tapioca flour to get the consistency you like. Now, place the crystal clear jelly brown slime to serve as the caramel sauce or topping. Place that in the ready to eat creme caramel flan cup. And then you have to top it off with the slime that you just made, which is thick, glossy, and chewy texture that makes awesome pops and pokes. Pretzel shaped slimes. I'm going to be using this to color the clear slime. The shades are from Naked Palette 1, 2, and 3. All mixed in one, and we're going to be making pretzel slimes with it. I'm going to be doing the U shaped method for making the pretzel, the classic twist. Pick up the two ends and twist them around each other twice. 
Take the twisted section of the pretzel and fold it over until the ends meet the bottom of the U. First shade is Blackout. It is the blackest black mat. Snake Bite. Satin bronze with golden sheen. Foxy. Cream bisque mat. Half baked. Golden bronze shimmer. Buzz. Rose with silver. Smog, deep coppery bronze shimmer. Busted, deep brown shimmer. Burnout, satin peachy pink. Limit, matte dusty rose. Buck, warm brown matte. YDK, cool bronze shimmer. Hustle, plum brown satin. Sweet candy slime. I am going to be using this ready made crystal clear jelly slime. And then I'm going to be using these miniature fake candy you can find this in any shop which has arson craft stuff nail art they look like real candy and they're just so tiny and adorable i'm going to cover the store-bought slime in this now press it all together you can see how the decorative miniature sweets are coming through the clear slime it looks great these miniature decorative candies are an excellent addition to your clear slime not only do they help create a visually appealing slime, they are also an easy way to make it crunchy. Now, you can find different sizes and colors of these sweeties for all your different needs and to help produce the crackling sounds you need. Rice Slime here I have some rice, uncooked of course. I'm going to be adding store-bought crystal clear slime to the rice. Now adding the rice is going to offer a great twist on the texture, it provides additional tactile sensory feedback. Adding rice creates beautiful, highly reflective slime that you will have fun squishing. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment and share this video. I really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye. Jazakallah khair. Thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out.